Hey everyone. So if you've watched a couple of these videos before, you've probably seen what I'm about to try sitting in the background on my stove there, and I just haven't got around to try it or been in the mood to try it till now. But these are Guinness flavored uh, potato chips. I found them at World Market. It's a weird store that's sort of like if Whole Foods and Pier 1 Imports had a baby. Um, but hey, I like potato chips. I like Guinness beer. If these are potato chips that actually taste like Guinness beer, I don't know, maybe they're good. I don't know. They're certainly overpriced. Anyway, um, so it looks like the ingredients, uh, potatoes, obviously, sunflower oil, yeast extract powder, sugar, buttermilk powder, rice flour, fat-reduced cocoa powder, salt, barley malt extract powder, and cream powder. Kind of the... I'm... Not sure what all that stuff is going to make this taste like. Buttermilk, you usually, buttermilk powder, you usually find in like ranch flavored things, but then cocoa powder is odd. Um, barley malt sounds delicious though, for barley malt extra extract powder, I don't know, but. Huh, I don't know if these are going to taste anything like Guinness beer, probably not, but. Mm, at least they license the name to them. They smell like a soft pretzel. It's kind of weird. They're, um, well, I'll pull one out here, but... This is a chip. Uh, it kind of has a, a similar look to the cappuccino lays that I tried, like, years ago. I think I still have that video up. Uh, it's, a uh, like, granular, like, sugar stuff. Come off my finger. Hmm, that tastes interesting. Almost vinegary. Ah, uh, vinegar's not an ingredient here, though. I don't know. So, um... Try a chip, and let's see what it tastes like. Huh. Well, it ain't Guinness, I'll tell you that much, but let me try another one. They taste like a burnt, so a lightly burnt soft pretzel. Um, back when I worked at the theater, if I left a um, soft pretzel in the Turbo Chef for too long, and it got a little bit um, darker than the uh, asshole customers would like, and they sent it back. Sometimes they sent it back just because it looked darker, even though it wasn't burnt at all, though. They're fucking idiots. Anyway, but, yeah, it tastes like if you cooked a soft pretzel, uh, slightly longer than it should be, so it has a slightly burnt taste to it, which is probably the malt taste. Um, but it's actually, it's pretty good though, I do like the flavor of it. Um, it's a weird flavor to capture, it doesn't taste like Guinness beer at all, it just tastes like a soft pretzel in chip form. So, I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Um, yeah. If you like the taste of soft pretzels, um, but you want to snack on some chips instead of actually eat pretzels, because it specifically tastes like soft pretzels, it doesn't taste like hard pretzels. It tastes like a soft pretzel in chip form, but just with a little bit of uh, singe to it. Um, if that sounds appetizing to you, I'd say go for it. You can probably find this at specialty food stores and grocery stores and things like that that sell stuff from, you know, the UK. Um, but, yeah, I mean, if you're expecting it to taste like Guinness, you'll be disappointed, but if, um, if it's, uh, if you like what I described it as, then, uh, yeah, take